My name is John Higgins. I'm a lifelong Nebraskan. I come from several generations of, of Nebraskans. Uh, you know, over the last, you know, my great 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 grandparents were homesteaders over from Sweden. So, uh, originally from Grand Island, Nebraska. That's where I did high school and went through the University of Nebraska system. Went to the University of Nebraska Lincoln and then did my med school here in uh, Omaha at the University of Nebraska Med Center. Then after that, tried to get out of Nebraska for a little bit. Did three years up at Mayo Clinic in Rochester. Did my internal medicine training up there, but it was a little too cold up there for my wife. So then we moved back to Omaha and I completed my cardiology fellowship here at the University of Nebraska. The great thing about cardiology is that it's it's really a different uh, thing on a day-to-day -day basis. So uh, I get great satisfaction seeing patients in clinic and being able to build up relationships with those patients over the course of uh, months to years and hopefully uh, guide them through everything for the rest of their lives. But on top of that, I also get to see patients that are sicker and more of the acute setting in the hospital and really try to you know use all the tools that we have of modern technology to try to help people out from you know, really dangerous situations where we didn't have the technology even 10, 20 years ago to, to really make the difference that we're making in people's lives today, whether it be uh, through interventional cardiology or advanced heart failure therapies or my special interest uh, using advanced imaging techniques to diagnose and prognose people with their heart problems. When you meet a patient, a lot of times they're nervous, especially with someone like me, I'm a younger doctor, but I really want to make them as comfortable as possible because they don't care about all you know what the degrees are in your wall or anything like that. They just want to be able to know that you know what you're doing and that they can trust you. And it's just so vital to just to sit down there and look them in the eye and just figure out who they are as a person and then being able to have them open up to you to be honest with you and that way you can work as a team and that's it's just really a collaborative environment. So outside of work I really enjoy uh, spending time with my wife and my two boys. They really keep me on my toes being at home and it's always just great finding some new adventure to do with them whether it's going you know, on a st to a state park, camping out in the backyard or just watching, watching them grow up. It's just a really satisfying thing to do. You know, on top of that, I try to keep myself busy reading books, lots, you know, whether it's fiction or nonfiction, history books. It's just really good to, you know, be able to read things that aren't necessarily related to medicine to use those experiences that you read in those books just in all, all aspects of your life. And on top of that, of course, love going to Nebraska Cornhusker football games and uh, non-cardiologist approved activities like barbecuing and cooking are, are really uh, something I look forward to. The great thing about Nebraska medicine is just the, the large team that we have here and how well everyone works here. I mean, for my patients, uh, you know, I get that personal care, but also within the hospital, you get uh, all of the staff there, the allied health staff, the residents, the fellows, all contributing to the care of the patient. And you, when you get all these folks looking at you know, a patient's care, you really do get, uh, bring out the best in everyone.